Hey guys, uh, today's video is using the fattest team in FIFA 19, um, so for the occasion, I thought I'd wear a fat suit. Don't be scared, this is not my real body, okay? Look at this, bad boy! Only cost me 900 quid, mate. Oh! I just smacked my stomach for you. If you don't like this video, then God help you. How's it going, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Brooksy HC. As you can see, I'm a hot boy today. You got a haircut and all that kind of thing, so I'm looking fresh as a daisy. Today, we're doing the fattest team in FIFA 19. I'm part of that gang, so uh, this should be fun. Now, bear in mind, these players, some of these players are literally here for their weight. Some of them are here because they look fat, and some of them are actually fat. Okay, some of them are just people that have misconceptions about them being fat. You'll see what I mean when we get into, into the video. Once again, if you could like this video before we get started, that'd be great. Subscribe if you're new around here. My name is Brooksy HD. Obviously, we do all these foot champs videos every week. We might do two of them in the next couple of weeks because I'm going to be uploading more videos. So look out for that. Just also want you to know that I have a mouth. I have a mouth, folks. Didn't know what you could tell. I have a loose tooth, but it's not really a loose tooth. It's like something underneath the tooth that's really, really sore. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, I was absolutely so in so much pain. Not in that much pain today. That's why I'm making a video. So please bear with me if I say stuff wrong or if I just go, ah, like that, because I will do. Right now, the thing with weight on FIFA 19 is that the only way you can check a player's weight in-game is you have to actually go in-game. There's no stat where all the stats are, where it tells you height and uh, weak foot and skills and stuff like that. There's no weight thing. You have to actually go in-game, so I thought it's very, very long. I'm just going to do what people conceive to be fat, people that are fat in real life, and check the websites and that's why Ariola is in goal because apparently he was the heaviest goalkeeper at the World Cup that's in FIFA he was 90 at hit what was it 95 kilograms which I don't I don't know how heavy that is but it's, I don't think it's that heavy compared to me anyway he's six foot five he's our goalkeeper he's actually a good player Fuji thinks he's really good so right back is Yeri Mina once again this is going off that World Cup thing uh he doesn't look too bad I mean, he's bad, but he's not that bad. We've got Harry Maguire up next once again, going off the World Cup thing. He was one of the heaviest boys in this. Uh, you, you all know about Harry, Harry Maguire. Left centre back then is Yannick Vestergaard, Danish international. He's once again another one of those people that was at the World Cup. Is there a theme going on here? John O'Shea at left back. Only added him in because he looks kind of overweight in his picture. He's not in real life. He's... He's a god! Right centre mid is a Gonzalo hot dog Higuain. You guys all know the stories about Gonzalo and his eating habits, let's put it that way, on planes. Uh, he's in the team because he, people misconceive him as being fat. He's not fat. He just likes hot dogs, okay? Leave him alone. Middle centre mid is a bit of a controversial one. I've gone for Bastian Schweinsteiger just because if you can remember when he used to play for United, he always looked a bit tubby, at least to me anyways. And I'm fat, so I... I get to say he was fat and not. At left centre mid then is Steve McNulty. If you've ever seen Steve McNulty in real life, you will know why he's on this list. St type in Steve McNulty. You can see his name there. Type that into Google and you'll see why he's on this list. At can then is Waza Rooney. Not actually fat at all, but people always have a misconception about him being fat. For whatever reason... I mean, maybe it's just because he's slow or something like that. I don't know. He's, I mean, he's not fat, but he's fat, apparently, according to people. Right striker is Romelu Lukaku. Once again, people, some people see him as fat. This was a bit of a controversial one. It's really, really hard to find players by weight on foot bin. You can't sort by weight. So you have to, like, literally individually pick people out. Lukaku was, uh, he booked up for the World Cup. That's why I added him in. And left striker, I'm fairly sure he's the heaviest player in the game. And that's not because he's fat. He's just a bleeding tank. People would say he is fat. Now, this is the team, ladies and gentlemen. It's not a good team. You've got 45 chemistry. This is going to be painful in person as well because my tooth is really sore. Don't forget about that. Now, that's an excuse I'm going to use if I lose. So let's get into a game, shall we? Right, so folks, as I'm wincing in pain right here, we're... Just want to clarify that on the bench we don't have any fat players, so we can't bring anyone on. The players we've got on the pitch are the players we have to use. This is the team we're playing against. It's not actually that meta of a team. The only players I would say that are meta in this team would be Aubameyang and Rudiger and Walker. Uh, everyone else is just a bit mediocre, to be honest. We've got Lukaku. We can do some damage with him. That's pretty much it. <laughs> well, he's through. John O'Shea has just blocked off the god. Steve McN oh, look at Steve McNulty. Go on, Bastion. You beast. Romelu. Okay, Rudiger's quite good, isn't he? Go on, Steve. Big Steve. Look at that man. He even looks fat in FIFA, bro. <laughs> he 
He's the closest thing in FIFA to Wayne Shaw. If you guys remember Wayne Shaw, I got half a million views off that guy. Oh, it's Steve McNulty. He's trying to get past Kyle Walker. I think if you literally flip Kyle Walker's pace stats around, you will get Steve McNulty's pace. Go on, Yannick. How is he? He's orange timed that against Ariola, bro. Ah, uh, what a joke. Yeah, I don't think we're going to get a win in this video, boys. Nonetheless, it'll be an interesting foray. Let's say. Oh, Yeri Mina with the saucy skills. Romelu. Oh, you've got to pass that quicker, bro. I read him like a bleeding chocolate biscuit, man, and he's still... Okay, Vestergaard can be headers. That's nice. Oh, my poopy. Oh, my God. It's still in, boys. Please, somebody lock onto it. Okay, this is not fun. He's actually scored off that. Are you kidding me, man? This is a joke. Ross Barkley just out jumps. I mean, I like Ross Barkley. Let's not get this twisted. He's a good Chelsea player. I've got you, brother. Romelu Lukaku, you've got to run. My big Belgian sausage, you've got to go. Cross the ball, you donkey man. Oh, John. It's all you, Johnny boy. There, you <laughs> there we go, you big sausage eater, boys. Oi. Oi. Oh. Should have passed. But I seen my name in lights. I mean, mean his name in lights. Waza. Waza's making that room near post. He's hit the post. He's actually hit the post. Come on, man. Stop with this BS, man. Go on, Johnny. You gotta keep five yards ahead of him. You won't keep keep up to him otherwise. He's trying to... He's trying to... Oh, my God. John O'Shea, have my bleeding children. I have time. Chapets and... Ch well, what am I saying? Chapets for just chaps. Oh, my God. This guy's a barrel. That is racist, EA. That is definitely not Romelu Lukaku. You absolute heathens. Take that. That's not Romelu Lukaku, bro. Ow, my tooth is so sore. Go on, Steve. Go on, Yeti. Yeti, man. Go on, son. Big six foot five. Powerhouse Steve McNulty. I knew what he was doing there. He meant to. Oh, let's get Steve McNulty a little run out, boys. Oh, look at that pass. It's only of Sadio Mane. Yeti, man. Oh, my God. Steve McNulty is actually a great CDM, bro. Oh, look at the touch. He's just rinsed Sadio Mane. He's actually just rinsed Sadio Mane. That's another question for you boys, right? Who would you say are fat players on FIFA 19? Now, obviously, they're professional footballers. They're not fat. Steve McNulty would be the only one that I would class as overweight. But he's fine with that. So that's that's okay. Who would you say would be the quote-unquote fattest players on FIFA 19? If I was dying on my knees, you would be the one to set me free. Holly Maguire. <laughs> These painkillers are really working, boys. <laughs> Not off me face, pal. The two legends of the game, Steve McNulty and John O'Shea. John O'Shea's making a gut-busting run. Look how he's, he's great. Akin Fenwa. Romelu Lukaku. It's... It's... Go! Oh. Come on, John. It's only Kyle Walker. What are you saying, G? He scored. Well... <sighs> Romelu. You're so bad. You're so sick. You are the best striker in this game. You're so bad, man. Oh, my God. How can you not score that, bro? Oh, it's true on goal there, folks. I can't believe that. Let's go into another game. I need to score a goal with this team. I'm not stopping until I do. I might stop after this game. But I'm not stopping until I score. I mean, this is the stereotypical Stephen McNulty picture, right? He doesn't look that big. I mean, compared to me, he's small. But uh, I think, I mean, he is technically overweight. I'm not wrong in saying that, am I? I? I mean, he definitely is. I'm obese. He's overweight. Here we go, boys. Just thought of another player for the team. We've got our main man, Charlie Adam, here. He's definitely what people would consider. I mean, I don't think he is overweight, but people think he is. Purely based on his, on his pace. So let's put him in for Mark McNulty, shall we? Let's see if we can score with... Charlie, I mean, John O'Shea's got a link now. That's sick. So what my plan is now, obviously, is to take off John O'Shea at halftime, surely. For for Stephen McNulty. <laughs> this is so sick, bro. I love it. Who will, uh, could be better. But uh, that brand card's a bit of a B-I-T-C-H. And that trap card I've never played against. Kevin Trap was beast on FIFA 17. Let's hope he's not as good as he was then. Why win with this team? 
this guy's literally just got to close down his whole ultimate team. Oh my god, this guy's not that great at all. Chip around the goalkeeper, Lukaku. Jesus Christ. Oh, Gonzalo. Who's, who called him fat? Who, who called him fat? I want your phone number right now. I'm going to call you up and tell you you're wrong. I dare say it, folks. This is probably the hardest challenge we've done so far. I mean, the lowest stamina one was really difficult. He's just scored. This is the only way I'm going to score. Chip him. Rom. Big Rom has scored. We have scored a goal with this team. Mission achieved. Accomplished. Mission accomplished. Big Rom. Look at all those fatties, mate. <laughs> They're going to cause an earthquake if they fall over. Look at the man, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. Can we please just stop with these stupid girls? Need you to make that pass, Akin. He's made it, but he's just taking so... He literally got the same first touch in real life. I didn't think FIFA was that realistic until I've seen that right there. Go on, John. Go on, Johnny. He's just pressed Y. That's all he's pressed there is just Y. Why do I have to make this team? <laughs> Bants, go away. Just go away. All of your players that have full chemistry. And all this other nonsense. It's not fair. Gonzalo. Okay. That was a goal, folks. If you didn't watch, that was a goal. That was a great goal. Right, boys. It's happening. Where is he? Steve, <laughs> Steve McNulty. <laughs> Me, if I was a football player. Coming on a left back on the lad. Let's go. He's he's a solid player. Oh my god, Charlie Adam. He's got a wand of a left foot. He's smacking that. That would have been a goal if there was no. We. I. I want to discard Romelu Lukaku. Romelu does a burger for two for one. Oh for Christ's sake! I'm trying to make a fat joke, and you just go and score. Why? This brand card is broken. I'd like Akin Fenwa to get a goal, but I don't trust him. So I'm just gonna let Rooney get a goal instead. What? <laughs> I can't believe it actually worked. I'm such a beast at this game, bro. Like, literally, they should just pay me to commentate. Imagine me commentating the E-Premier League, okay? Imagine how awful that would be. Oh. My. Word. The composure off of that. Rom. Big Rom. Ah, that's an elbow to the cheek! Oh. Oh. Oh! No! Kevin! Why? Oh, I'm proud of that last game, boys. We put in a fight. If it wasn't for this bleeding Julian Brandt red card, we would have won that game. Sorry, I'm just laughing to myself. Steve McNulty's got a 7.1 in a foot champs game, folks. I never thought I would see the day. Thank you so much for watching this video, boys. It's been a pleasure as always. As I said, stay tuned to the channel. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe. Make sure you hit the bell button so you get notified when I upload a video. I'm going to be uploading, trying to upload anyways, two videos. I mean, a video every two days. So if you like that kind of stuff, make sure you subscribe. Like the video too if you haven't already. And I will see you in the next... Hopefully we I can win. I mean, I just, look, I'm just, this is depressing me. Having no wins on foot champs. God, it's annoying. See you then. Bye.